welcome to my channel today we are going to discuss a reflection of light at curved surfaces in this chapter we discuss multiple choice questions explain with videos it is a level 1 10th class exams purpose so let start first question the light travels in a path which takes least time to travel the statement given by snell newton fermat bohr answer is fermat second question all the distance related to spherical mirrors will be measured from object to image focus of the mirror pole of the mirror image to object answer is pole of the mirror dash mirrors is called converging mirror concave mirror convex mirror plane mirrors none of the above answer is concave mirror observe the the following video focus center of curvature dentist uses a dash mirrors to observe the teeth another model of this question the mirrors used by ent specialist is plane mirror and of the above answer is concave mirror which mirror is called diverging mirror option a concave mirror option b convex mirror option c plane mirror option d none of the above answer is convex mirror observe the following video we take convex mirror draw a principal axis and identify the pole focus and center of curvature observe the picture clearly which mirror has wider field of view option a concave mirror option b convex mirror option c plane mirror option d none of the above answer is convex mirror observe the following video take convex mirror draw a principal axis identify the pole incident ray reflected ray incident ray reflected ray now this is a field of view this is a field of view so concave mirror has wider field of view next question concave mirror is used as shaving mirror focusing mirror rear view mirror vehicle headlights reflector answer is rear view mirror from this picture we use concave mirror to observe the picture 
next one generally pole is generated by this symbol p option a p b f option c c option d or answer is a generally pole is generated by p here we learn some more questions here pole is generated by p focus is generated by f center of curvature is generated by c radius of curvature is denoted by r next question the distance between pole and focus is called answer option a radius of curvature b focal length c center of curvature d principal axis answer is focal length observe the picture next one the distance between pole and center of curvature is called radius of curvature focal length center of curvature principal axis so answer is radius of curvature observe the picture or image next one a ray which seems to be traveling through the focus of the convex mirror path of the reflected ray of an instant ray answer is options is parallel to axis through the focus through the c along the same path in opposite direction the answer is along the same path in opposite direction next question we get diminished image with a concave mirror when the object is placed option a at f option b between p and f at c option c option d behind c so answer is behind c observe the picture now next question if an object is placed at c on the principal axis in front of the convex mirror the position of the image is at infinity between f and c at c behind c so answer is at c observe the picture next question size of the image formed by a convex mirror is always option a enlarged option b diminished option c equal to the size of the object option d depends upon the position of the object always diminished observe the picture here we are using convex mirror the object image is very diminished next question is we get virtual image in a concave mirror when the object is placed it's a very special case for convex mirror concave mirror at f between p and f at c behind c so answer is between p and f observe the picture okay next question is which mirrors are used in saloons option a concave mirror convex mirror plane mirror and none of the above oh, answer is plane mirror next question is the line joining the pole and the center of curvature of a mirror is called the dash pole focus principal axis 
focal length answer is principal axis next question the image which can be obtained on a screen is called option a real a virtual image a real image either a real or virtual image neither a real or virtual image answer is a real image next question is the image which cannot be obtained on the screen is called a virtual image option b a real image option c either a real or virtual image option d neither a real or virtual answer is a virtual image observe the picture we get answer clearly next question is a virtual image is always inverted always erected either erect or inverted neither erect or nor inverted answer is always erect observe the picture next one is the virtual image it is formed when the ray of light appear to meet a point so convex mirror always form a erect and virtual image geometrical center of the sphere surface of the mirror is called option a pole option b focus c center of the curvature d principal axis <coughs> answer is pole observe the picture next one is a vessel is kept at the dash of the solar cooker pole focus center of the curvature principal axis answer is focus observe the picture now a vessel is put at a focus point so which mirrors are used in headlights concave mirrors and convex mirrors option c concave and convex d none of the above answer is concave mirrors the scientist who used mirrors to be to burn ships was option a fermat option b newton option c archimedes option d snell answer is archimedes now last question is the focal length of concave mirror if the radius of curvature is 20 cm to find focal length option a 20 cm b 40 cm c 10 cm d 30 cm so answer is 10 cm now we get explain here the relation between f and r is r is equal to f so here given capital r is equal to 20 cm to find focal length f is equal to r by 2 then f is equal to 20 by 2 answer is 10 cm thank you for watching my channel thank you for watching my channel 